Hi fiends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 193 in Best Fiends. This is Blue Lagoon. Our goals are to defeat six slugs, clear out 14 of the green muck, and open four crates. And let's see, because I already lost to this level, but I do like... Oh, I've got a different fiend selection now. They have given me different ones than the others that they... No, maybe this is it. Dennis, Gordon, Buggles, and Jojo are all horizontal. And Vincent, yeah, I don't know why I didn't remember Dennis being part of that before. But these are my five recommended auto-select Buggles. And that makes sense because we need a lot of horizontal help over here. That's not the only thing we need. We need a lot of points. I actually lost to the fact that I couldn't get rid of all the slugs last time. So I'm going to be very careful about that. Now I've got a really good setup here because I've got a lot of blue on this board. And I like that because I want to try to get Buggles to give me a bomb fairly quickly. So I could go down here and that would help with the slime. But I know that I need to go point-wise, so I'm going to go this way and try to collect as many points as possible. Plus, of course, I'm trying to get rid of these barriers on the board. I will get rockets, so that's going to be real helpful in clearing out all the rest of this stuff. And look at this, I can send off both rockets right now and collect enough blue to already get a bomb. Now, the, the rockets only take off one layer of slime, of muck, and the rockets only take out one layer of the crates. The bombs take out all three layers of the crates, but still only one layer each of the muck. So I want to try to use these against the crates if I can. It makes the most sense for me. I do want to try to hold on to the purple if I can, because it's going to become very useful very soon. I like this move here. Sending off the rocket through the muck, holding on to the purple, setting up maybe the red, and maybe bringing the blue down here a bit so it can help with some of these crates. All right, here we go. And now would be a good time to try to use purple, and I'm hitting that rocket, and I'm hitting that rocket. That looks good to me. So 15,000 against that slug is going to help, and thank you, Dennis, very much. And now I think... This looks like a good option, right? I hit a rocket, I hit, I use a bomb, so I hit a crate completely, and I get 14,000 points. I don't think I can get more points, and I also like what that does for the board. See, that's not going to be nearly as much. So I'm going to go ahead and take this right now. That's 14. It's the same either way. Taking out muck, taking out crates. Ooh, I get a key this time. I love that. Uh, I don't have any purple to help me out here, so I'll just take the most likely move here. Uh, so that gets me 4,000 and removes some muck. This would get me 1,800 and remove some muck and a key, but we're going to go this route. We'll, we should still be able to collect that key within 19 moves. All right, I could take out the purple. That would get me 4,700 points. And it is the affiliated color. But this gets me more points, 8,100. Let's just double check a few things. Uh, just seeing how much I need to get these bombs going. That's 6,000, but this was a bit better. And I like the muck removal. Unaffiliated slug, blue slug. So now I want to try to avoid taking out the blue if I can. But I like taking out the crates. Ooh, got a bomb. All right, I think I'm going to do this. I'm not going to avoid the blue entirely. If it makes sense for me to use it to get good points, I will. But look at what I can do here. 9,600 and it takes out a crate. 11,000 and it takes out a crate. And it takes out some muck and it takes out a shell. And it gathers up that blue if I can hold on to it. And I think I will because look what I'm going to do. Although I still have to get rid of this guy and I might not have enough 
points to do it. Let's see, if I do this, I get 4,200. If I do that, it's substantially less. I think I will take out this blue. It just makes the most sense. I'll still have some blue on the board, uh, and I still have another turn before I can actually collect anything. This hits that crate, gives me 3,200, connects some of the blue, hopefully, and maybe gives me, there we go, a bomb. So all the crates are gone and almost all the muck is gone in here. I don't have to worry about that. I need to worry about these slugs. 12 moves to get these slugs. Instead of taking out blue right away, I might do this. Oh wow, that hits a lot of stuff, including that bomb. Kind of okay with that. It's also going to hit some of the blue, which is okay. That's what's giving me the, the points here. So that's 11,000. If I do this, that's 11,000. Let's, oh, and is that a bomb yet? No. Let's do this. Let's take out the purple, and then we'll probably take out the blue. Because I think we're going to get another bomb from Dennis, and we get more blue this way. This is a good choice. Okay. All right, and that gives me 27,000, so that takes that slug out completely. Now, I do have to pay attention to the fact that I've got some triple thick muck over here. Uh, unaffiliated slugs now. The last two slugs don't have any particular color to them. I think it's going to be best for me to maybe do this and get 19,000 and hit that muck. I know I've got that strawberry muck in there. Um, let's just check what else I might be able to do. What if I use the strawberries up here? I don't get a bomb from it. I do reposition things where I might be able to reach the muck, but remember my problem last time was the points. So I think I'm going to do this. I think that's best for points. And I'll still have a bomb here that I might be able to use and some rockets that may, oh, or I could just do this. Look at that. I can get all the muck this way. Hmm. I don't know how to reach a couple of those strawberries. But that gets me 9,900. And I still have a bomb on the board and all the muck is gone. I like that move. Oh wait, not all the muck is gone. Where's my one muck left? Oh, right up here. Did not even see that. All right, so let's see what I can do now. I can try to take out a bomb, try to go for the points that way, or I could try to set up more bombs so I have more points, more uh, what's? Yeah, more points for the future. That's not going to create a bomb, but it is going to clear out a lot of stuff Hmm. I could set up this bomb. That's not a lot of points. I could not quite get a bomb. Or I could set off this bomb. That's 15,000. But I'm going to do this because I do want to make sure I can use all of the bombs I have on the board. All right, let's see. This would get me 20,000 points. That looks really good at this point in time, but I'm gonna check other things. That gets me 6,000 points, but it does not get me a new bomb. Uh, this gets me 2,000. It does not get me a new bomb. That's 14,000. That's 5,000, but I like the way it sets things up. I'm going to go for this, knowing that I still have a few moves left, although I still have muck left that I haven't gotten rid of. Oh, hey, got to be careful on that one. All right, so let's see what I can do with all of this. If I do this, 
I get 29,000 points and I set off a lot. That looks good. If I do this, I get 7,000 points, plus I clear out some of this slime and maybe rearrange things. If I do this, I get 16,000. If I do this, I get 25,000 and I get rid of the muck. But I think I can just do, hold on, go this way. Yeah, doesn't make much difference, does it? But I get rid of that muck. That's what I need to do. And then four moves for just a little bit left here. Now I've used up most of my bombs. That's still a good amount. So doing this is only going to help things. There we go. Okay, so it was nice knowing now that uh, I could do this without too much difficulty. Notice I'm going to leave the bombs on the board because I want them to stay. It, it was because I realized that I was going for slugs this time. Before I thought it was going to be so hard to reach into these crevices and that's where my attention was focused for the first part of the game and so I wasn't caring as much about the points. Then when I understood what the real difficulty was going to be on the board, I was able to adjust my strategy. So let's see what we get here. We're going to open all of these, ooh, diamonds, 190 diamonds. And then I'm going to choose the ones we're going to open on the next one. So I stopped it. And I get to choose the center and the side for yellow, wonderful meteor mites. All right, that is it for that one. Oh, look at that, looking for love. I defeated all of the slugs I needed to defeat, so I get to collect seven more keys and find out what my next task is going to be. I need to beat new world map levels with Dennis. I need to collect purple blocks and I need to upgrade Dennis to level 14. I probably don't have enough yellow meteor mites yet to get that done. I might decide to use diamonds, but I do like Dennis, so I will be upgrading him. That's it for now. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.